Star Wars is now 40 years old. Welcome to Fat Man Batman. I'm Kevin Smith. I'm Mark Bernard. Uh, okay, so Star Trek Discovery is happening, whether you want it to or not. <laughs> what is the sonic power Black Canary uses called in the comic book? Canary Cry? Correct! Do you want 10% off of all your geek swag and your gamer swag on drinks.com? Well, use the promo code quitstalling underscore 366 when you check out your Overwatch Pachimari pocket tees or your Overwatch Pachimari ceramic mugs. Or if for some reason you actually like the Anthem game that EA has put out, the Anthem game, the Anthem game that EA has put out, you can purchase some of that swag that Anthem has on the Jinx.com store and save yourself 10% off of all of it using the promo code quitstalling underscore 366 when you check out. Welcome everyone to the Quitstalling Geek Cast. I am your host. I am Harold Silvestre. And as the people in the chat are saying, it's the Kyusu. It's not the Kyusu. But uh, welcome everyone. The Quitstalling Geek Cast is your weekly fix, hopefully weekly fix. For ge geek and pop culture things. Today, of course, we've got a, we're a little light on news, guys. We're a little light on news, but it's fun because it's Pokemon week. we got a lot of Pokemon news to talk about today. I uh, want to give a shout out to the folks in the chat. Francis Shu, Human Panda, Bemo King of Ooh, and so much more. But uh, you know what? Let's get to my co-hosts. First of all, this man is known as the Chosen One. It's Wancho Saldana. How you doing, buddy? Hey, what's up, guy? And Woo. you forgot the relation to Zoe thing. Oh, you, you, uh, you miss that. it? Yeah. Do you miss it? Yeah, Do you yeah, miss it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But well. yeah, hey, anyway, what's up, guys? I'm hyped for the show just because it's going to be all Pokemon news, basically. And we're going to be talking <laughs> about a pretty cool show I got into over the weekend. Oh, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. yes, we will. Let's get yes, into we that. will. <laughs> yes, we will. We, like me and Derek, like back when me and Derek first watched it we knew you hadn't seen it yet because you didn't make a big deal out of it and like uh yeah so yeah, i guess you liked it i guess you liked it and speaking of derek we have a man from the far far west he is known to his grasshoppers as the sensei of humor ladies and gentlemen please welcome derek o'brien what is up my grasshoppers hi hi Weird flex, but okay. That was a Zelda sword. Yeah. Oh. But you guys don't have that. Yeah. You guys yeah. probably do. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Welcome, guys. <laughs> I almost put that oh, my wife. Sorry, babe. Uh, oh, no. Well, anyways. Hi. And hi. I'm excited to be back. And like Wancho said, he knows a lot more about Pokemon than I do, but I'm very excited that I love Pokemon as well. Um, I mean, everyone it's exciting Pokemon, week. right? I mean, you know, it's the Geek Cast Strikes Back. They just named that oh. name of the episode right there. Oh. I just thought about it. <laughs> we, we, I mean, we could, we could, right? Who right. Like I mean, Pokemon, I, I, man. I know that's true. If you don't like Pokemon, um, please do not watch this. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, but no, but seriously. You know what? How about this? If you don't like Pokemon, <laughs> we'll change your mind. Mm. If you don't like Pokemon, don't mm. worry. We'll we'll we'll, re we'll remake it in 3D and just slap evolution at the end of the yeah. title. Don't worry. Exactly. Don't worry. Right. Exactly. <laughs> Oh man! So welcome everyone to the Quitslang Keycast once again. Uh, yeah, it, it, we're light on on other pop culture stuff. I think it's like the calm before the storm, because uh, what? Because I know we're we're about due for like the the release of the name of Star Wars, uh, Episode Nine. Oh, so who's excited about that? Oh okay. god! Oh god! <laughs> me, and me, calm, and buddy. Me. Calm. We have three Pokemon news things. Three. This is a crazy, always this hope. Is a crazy week. This is a con. This is a con. Hellions are well, one on hope. Well, there's that. There's um. <laughs> we also have uh, Captain Marvel upcoming and uh, Avengers Infinity. Oh, Endgame coming up as well. So yeah, yeah. Mm. Uh, real quick, I want to give a shout out to that handsome man, Sensei Humor, for uh, subscribing to the channel. Thanks, Sensei. This is your yeah, like, sixth that month. Is. Thank you so much. I think it's a uh, sense of humor sixth month, so welcome, welcome back. 
Uh, I, I made a joke on on Game Bite because uh, our former bit cheer leader Elder Jin uh, has become like our official fourth rotating host. And uh, I made a joke that you could actually buy your way onto the show. So I guess <laughs> Sensei did the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Oh, man. Sensei, no reaction. NR, man, no reaction to, to that news. He's like, I don't care. I'm still here. I'm still here. But uh, I was just I'm making sure, too. Francis said the stream is jumpy. Um, I might be. I was just testing to make sure we weren't doing anything. So, Francis, it might. I'll just try reloading it, dude, maybe on your end. I tried to see on mine. It wasn't jumping from mine, but then again, I'm not sure. Just it's keep that Philippine it internet. Happens. That's that Philippine internet. That smart internet. Yeah, it's just redundant because. <laughs> it's it's redundant. Enough. It's uh, it's ironic. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the word I meant. Oh man! All right. Well, guys, we start the show off by asking my co-hosts, and, you know, they ask me in return what, what they've been up to over the past week. Wancho, I know you mentioned it uh, quite a bit during the, just a little bit during the pre-show, but uh, let the folks at home know what you've been, uh, you know, what you've been dabbling in recently. Dang, dang. Uh, so, <laughs> I'll do it again, I'll do it again later. Okay, okay. So, but... <laughs> Actually, lately... Uh, me and Derek have been playing a lot of Divinity. That's honestly, you don't understand, yeah. Harold, how much, how much we're sacrificing right now to be on the show. <laughs> just because we were, we were a little playing and it was, we were just having, we were having a blast. But you know, I'm glad to be here. Uh, other than that, oh, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to be shoutcasting for the hey. Overwatch group in Fatime. And I'm pretty hype about that. Fanime is a Ooh. huge event. It's a huge event. Like, it's four days of just all anime goodness. And I'm also going to be a, a stage host, which I'm pretty hype about that. I Look at this guy! C cutting work to, to have some fun. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, it, That's I'm awesome, lucky. dude. My schedule, is, my schedule fits it. Well, you know how. Oh, okay. Your four times a week. So, that's perfect. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, uh, yeah, I'm just hyped about that. I, I, I honestly need another co-host though, for real. Okay. All right. I, real, I hear right. you, man. All right. I'm on the way. <laughs> He's like, I'm, I'm just gonna fly way. down there right now. Yeah. That's what Harold's like. I'm coming, dude. <laughs> I'm on the way. I hear you. Okay. No need to beg. No need to beg. <laughs> He's like, this is not my studio. I'm actually in the quit stalling airplane right now. <laughs> <laughs> Derek, it's, it's it's the QS private jet. Oh, sorry, I forgot. Oh, You're man. right. You're right. Air, uh, air stalling flight uh, zero zero. <laughs> yeah, yeah man, that's, that's kind of bad for an airplane name, but <laughs> yeah, I know. Air stalling. <laughs> Welcome to air stalling today. We're gonna be. Uh... Well, no, stalling no, air. Yeah. Would, would, would quit air sound better? Quit air. <laughs> quit air. <laughs> quit air. Oh, yeah, anyway, so that, oh, that nah. was my week. Uh, what about you, Harold? What have you? Oh man. I, oh, I, I like how it's it's me. Oh, that's that's awesome. Real quick, uh, shout I out like to that. Jason underscore shock result in the chat. Uh, he's up, asking Jason? what's he's asking uh, what's new, fresh, and how you'll find out in just a little bit, Jason. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. I, well, before I, before I compose myself and figure out what what I've been up to, like yeah, I think I think air stalling is the worst name for an airplane, <laughs> for an airline. So yeah, let's let's not call it that. Let's not call it that. But um, yeah, I I got to I got to watch season two of the Dragon Prince. So that's been that's been pretty good, one show. You know what I'm saying? Sorry, Derek. We'll we'll we'll, we'll, we'll talk about it next game. We'll, we'll talk about I'm it excited. next week. I'm excited. Uh, yeah, it's, it's like Wancho. Like you weren't expect. I know we'll talk about this later, but I know you weren't expecting that, right? Like you weren't expecting it to be as good as it was. I guess it's a hooky. No, somewhere? yeah, I, I wasn't Benji? expecting. I yeah, I, I I thought it was another one of those kiddie shows at Netflix. You know, how they just put oh. those out. You know. Yeah. Like, yeah, oh, they it's do. Just, <laughs> it's cheap. Yeah, it's CG. You know, like cheap CG yeah. maybe. Yeah, <laughs> it, was, it was really good. I mean, we'll talk yeah. about it later. We'll talk about it. Yeah, we will. We will. That's tr truth. Truth. All right. So, uh, what else have I been up to this week? Uh, I'm, I'm trying to get fit, you know. 
playing a little, playing a little Ooh. b-ball. Not just an NBA 2K oh. <laughs> anymore. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually playing real basketball now. <laughs> play, play actual basketball now. Get, get, getting things back in rhythm. You know, just, just crossing fools up. You know, yes. breaking ankles. Oh, oh! Get that home run touchdown. Yeah, <laughs> Yes, sports lingo. Sport, sports ball. Yes, sports uh, lingo. <laughs> lingo. Uh, we we had a good show on Game Bite. Uh, just, just fixing a couple of things for Quit Song. Like, have you guys, as you guys have been seeing, uh, we've been putting up talking points for the shows now to promote. Like, oh, you can download the podcast on Spotify and all that. Uh, and just coming out with clips, like when we promoted. Uh, our newest shoutcaster on quit stalling, uh, the man known as Renzo Soros. So it's been pretty good. It's been a pretty good week. Uh, yeah, aside from that, like it's 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 been it's been all about sports ball for me. Right? Sports ball, sports ball. It's been a sports ball week for me. Uh, gotta get same man. Sports points, man. Gotta get them sports. <laughs> points. <laughs> oh my gosh, Sensei man. What what have you been up to? Uh, I was actually doing this really cool thing, as you can just see. I was like trying to hit Wacho the whole time on the corner. Oh, I is that what you're trying to do? And, I thought he was gonna catch on and be like this, but no, it's fine. I, no, I thought I, there I, was I, something I, in your room that you're trying no. to fix. Oh no, I was like trying to like, like I was like looking at him. I was gonna say, Wacho has new headphones. <laughs> Wait, Dude, I've had these for a while. Yeah, how, I swear like, you've always. I might just be used to you wearing the earphones. That's probably why I'm just not. Yeah, really used yeah. To it. We we got so yeah. used to it. We got so used to it. I know, I know. Man. It's it's. I'm happy though that it actually looks good. But anyways, back to me. So you know, I just been um, around the villages, being sensei. You know, weird oh. flex, but okay. Uh, <laughs> divinity. That's all I've been doing. Honestly, <laughs> being one of them playing, dude. So it's funny because we usually play every Saturday. But lately, like, kind of almost, almost started singing the song Happier. Lately, I better be listening to that song a lot. So that's something else, too. Uh, but anyways, yeah, we usually play Saturdays. Uh, usually every other Saturday, too, which is funny. But lately, things have been going crazy. So we're like, we have to keep playing. We have to keep playing. And it just keeps happening and happening and happening. We're like, okay, we're just going to keep playing. But, uh... We're like, and you guys. Yeah, exactly. That's all we talk about. Uh, and it's crazy, um... I, I told you guys two weeks ago, I think about on the other show that I was having, I got a promotion. I believe so. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so tomorrow's my official last day at my Seattle branch. And so, um, and then I got, I'm going to Vegas next week. So, if anyone watching is there by any chance, feel free to say, hey, Sensei, let's, let's meet up, you know? Yeah. I'll be down. Uh, I'll be there by myself for a lot of the day. So, let you're not going know. to Fanime though. You're not. You're not. You're not. I. I know. I wish I could, but I've never heard of it until he said something, and now I wish. Oh, I heard about it because he said thirty-five thousand people. I'm like, uh, what? What? I need to go. That's a lot of people. But I mean, speaking of cons, I think we should all make a pact to go to next year's TwitchCon. Just saying. Oh. <laughs> I don't. Mind but anyway, it. no. That's like right that's there for me. Yeah. You know, it's. Like, it'll. It'll be like oh, yeah. cake for you guys. <laughs> Watcher's like, yeah, you mean my next door neighbor? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Just like right there. Dude, uh, I realized we, I literally right next live next to you two. Oh, really? wow. It's a walk, yeah, it's a walk away from me. Wow. So we know, so we know what we're saying if we go to Cali. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, breaking news. Uh, Wancho secured yeah. a deal for quit stalling yeah. on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think other than that, though, uh, I, I don't think there's anything much new with me. Besides, yeah, I'm going to Vegas next week, and I start my new job, well, new position on oh the 11th, so it's going to be exciting. Uh, but other than that, yeah, just having back in the show and ready, and just Good ready stuff. to talk about new man, I'm excited. Yeah. Okay, real quick. You know what I I, I found out last week? Uh, I was watching Hot Ones. I was watching the Hot Ones on First We Feast, and they had, uh, am I saying this right, uh, Jesus and Miro? From from uh, from Viceland, you guys know that. Okay, you, you know those guys. I yeah, I think no I know what you're talking about. Oh, so those guys remind me of Derek so much. Want to? I'll link you to really? to the Hot Ones episode, and they remind I me of know, Derek. I, I appreciate that. Do you guys actually? They're, they're funny guys. Those guys are entertaining as hell. Yeah. 
<laughs> Someone reminds I me like of Derek. That. I just I just can't see online. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> really? <sighs> is it is it R rated? Is it? It's a. Uh, it's it's no. someone in a European country. <laughs> I'll just tell you that. Oh really? Yeah. After show. It's an explosive show, person. Dark. Okay. Okay. You know, okay. out there, you know. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll, well, we'll save that for the after show. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we, we got we got a couple of news bits to talk about, so we might as well get to them, right? Uh, anything? Any shout outs you guys want to give before we get started? Just a uh, shout out to Francis for still watching, despite the. Ooh, oh uh, yeah, Francis, drop, dude. Sorry that it's you know? dropping. Yeah. yeah. Sorry. Dude. That's our bro. That's our guy right there, Francis. Like I'm sure he. So this is this is how I know Francis is so good to us. Is he watches us live, and I'm pretty sure he still downloads the, the episodes afterwards. And like, he might be that guy that just gives us a view on YouTube. <laughs> he's just, he's everywhere. Thank you, Francis. Francis Thank you're you such so a guy. Much. Yeah, I love you, dude. Yeah, thanks, man. Wancho would have been able to meet Francis, but you know. Are you guys coming in March, by the way, before I forget? Are you guys coming in March? Oh, I'm coming in March. I'm, I'm, I'm going home in two weeks, actually. Oh, okay. That. I got to hook you guys up with anymore. some swag then. Wait, what's that? What's yeah. that there? Dude, I need swag. I can't come anymore. You can't? Why? Oh, because of your new position? You should yes, go to the doctor. That that's, that's and bad. That's actually... Oh, okay, I'm, I'm going to say that is why. Because really... I mean, it is that. But the original reason before I could even... Uh, before I even got that position was... Um, it's something with Chloe's visa. She can't leave the country yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's, okay. it sucks. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, but, it's, understandable. it's understandable. It will happen. It will happen. It will happen. We will all get together. I know. Yeah. It will what, happen. what I can do is uh, I can give Wancho your merch, and he can just mail it to you, or like next time you guys meet up. That's true. Yeah, that will work. I need I need swag to wear for the yeah, man. gig. Yeah, Heck yeah. Just saying. US yeah. on my jacket. That's it. Oh yeah. It's gonna be fire. That'd be it's sick, dude. <laughs> it's gonna be so good. Honestly, all right. When's the con? The jacket you just... Yeah. When, when is the con, Wancho? Yeah. Oh, it's yeah, when's uh, the con? May. May. May Fanime is in May, so oh fan ah did they do that on purpose? I have no idea. I have no idea. That's pretty smart. Fanime. <laughs> oh man, Francis yeah, says. I was say you can oh. get a template of a shirt too, and just you know go to a shirt shop and just like yeah, print it too if you have to. We actually have a jacket design, dude. Have you seen it? It looks really. Cool. We have we I have, have a sweet it, hoodie really and cool. shirt. We have dude, a sweet hoodie design and like sweet shirt designs. I gotta. I'm. I'm actually promised everyone that I'll get them done this month. So, cause I wanna, I wanna use it on the show also. Like I'm me yeah, myself. Right? I wanna walk around town. I wanna work look out. This. Look at it. Look at this plain red hoodie and two black hoodies. No? Uh, uh, um, excuse me, my Twitch hoodie, dude. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Derek's like, excuse me, I bleed purple. Excuse me. No, I. I actually plan to take this. Um, on the back, I want to put like my logo, and then also like under it, put like at quit stalling at like Twitch TV. Like I kind of, I'm not sure how I want to do the layout, but basically like Twitch TV slash sense of humor, then like quit stalling, then like you know what I mean. I can put like shows yeah. around uh, it. You should, street, have, like, like, you should have like quit stalling over here on your arm, and then the other one sense Ooh. of humor. And then just do this. So stupid. <laughs> Hey, that would tell me that if you went to a con and just stood in the middle of the floor and did that, like don't. Oh man, in, dude. Be <laughs> so dumb, oh. so good though. That's that's hilarious. That's hilarious. <laughs> all right, all right. Well, let's. let's, let's... <laughs> would yeah. you do it though, let's Derek? Continue. Would you? Would you actually do it? I totally would, dude. I totally would dab for like. You know what I mean? That would be. Like, dab for and then they're like, "What does it say?" And I'm going too fast. They don't know what's happening. And then I'd be like, bam. Duh. After I'd be out of breath, too. I'd be like, oh my God. I, I love how you said that like it was your yeah. internal anime monologue. I know, right? Yeah, exactly right. Oh my gosh. All right. Oh, God. Oh, yes, to the news. Right, what we're <laughs> supposed to be doing. Oh, is that what we're going to do? Yeah. Yeah, right. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's head up the news. It's time for the news, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yes. Oh, I see. Good news, everyone. 
It's the news, and it's brought to you by Game Bite, 9.30 p.m. Wednesday nights, Philippine Standard Time. Yes, check it out, Game Bite, where you see that wonderful face of Instant DZ, who kind of looks like Jack Black. Yes! Yes! Game Bite, 9.30 p.m. Philippine Standard Times on Wednesday, 6.30 a.m. California up until, I think, next week is when Daylight Savings is, right? Is that next week? Is that next week? Well, we'll figure it out. Oh my God. We'll figure it out. Right. <laughs> you, oh my God. The people at home have phones, don't they? They'll, they'll figure it out themselves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Welcome, everyone, to the news. And uh, you know what? You know what? It's a... Uh, I know it's Pokemon week, and we'll get to that in just a second, but it's also that time of the year, Wancho and Derek, where shows start to get renewed. You know? Yes. And I'm excited, like, we, we don't have too much on, on that front yet, because it's it's just starting. It's just starting. But I'm... Spoilers, though. None of them are oh. Marvel. Oh, that's harsh. That's cold. <laughs> wow, dude. <laughs> Jesus. Shots fired, literally. <laughs> That's cold, oh man. God. Oh my god. <laughs> we already know, okay? Just how everybody goes. Jeez. That's, that's that, wow. Off the back of last yeah. week's episode, Wancho throwing some straight fire. Uh, right? Yeah. Yeah, so it's a season of, your, of renewals, and I'm, 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 I'm pretty excited to see what's going to get renewed. Because uh, sometimes it's also drama filled, you know? Things you, you think will be for sure renewed. Like, like Brooklyn Nine Nine right. uh, last year weren't renewed, and thankfully though, thankfully this year, it has been. Brooklyn Nine Nine is officially getting Woo! one more season on NBC because NBC apparently Love loves video. them so much. Cool, 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 cool. No doubt, no doubt, no doubt, no doubt. I was telling Harold earlier in in Wanto uh, for the chat to know that. That seeing that video it just makes me really happy, man. Just seeing them like they're all genuinely like, excited to have the show yes. renewed, and I I, yeah. I honestly think it has a lot to do with the fans, man. Like I remember when the show got canceled, all the fans on all my page even like, oh my god, I can't believe this is actually getting canceled. Please come back, like please do this petition, please bring it back. Yes. And it's just that was just on my Facebook. I can't imagine on everyone else's, you know, around the world. So yeah. probably reached out. And they're like, you know what, we gotta do it. We're bringing it back. I'm really happy they actually decided. To I do mean, awesome. I'd also be really happy if, if you know, I was on the show, you know, getting paid millions of dollars. Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> that's a yeah, pretty I mean, good reason to be happy. Yeah, uh, yeah, that's true. One day, true. one day, <laughs> one day. Uh, as Fran, as Francis so eloquently puts it in the chat, nine nine. Nine nine. Nine nine. So yeah, uh, for those of you unaware uh, of what we're talking about right now, specifically because. I, uh, on the video feed, we have a video of the moment that the cast and crew find out that they've been officially renewed by NBC. And it's, it's a pretty heartwarming video. Uh, yeah. I think a producer oh, yeah. or someone from NBC walks into a table read uh, from what it looks like and informs them. And everyone's genuinely and hella surprised because I guess, you know, they weren't expecting it either this soon or... You know, they, they just were too busy working on the show that it, it just caught them off guard. And to see everyone kind of react this way is pretty heartwarming after, like, what Derek mentioned uh, last year when they got canceled by Fox. And then you had all these celebrities and, and fans go out and, and say how much they love the 99. Mark Hamill w was one of the people that went on Instagram and Twitter to say that he loves the show. Right. Uh, low key, I'm not updated on 99. That's fine. <laughs> uh, now, now, you, now you can wait an now extra have, season. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. It's because oh, it's man. not on Netflix here. I only get to watch it. Oh, okay. If I mean, we have our review folder, right? We have the full. I could, I could toss it up if you guys want to talk about it on the show. Hi, hi, FBI coon. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just oh, do man. it when you're going to the Philippines so you don't have a really, you know. <laughs> just yeah, binge it in the Philippines. Yeah, just, yeah, exactly. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, but, yo, know, that, that reminds me, guys. Next week, aside from the Dragon Prince Season 2 getting reviewed here on the Quitstong Geek Cast, we'll also, you know, dabble a bit 
on Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse because yes, I, yes, it's about damn time. <laughs> I can't wait. I'm watching that on Saturday. I already have that planned out. It's excited. I'm excited to watch that. Oh man, it's multi just, award winning. I can't winning. believe it's. I know, and it's like, dude, two superhero movies won an awards at the Oscars. That's insane to me. Oh, what, so good. What's more impressive? It's. I think it's the first time since 2006 that that award didn't go to Disney. Wow, yeah, the, the animated, uh, animated, best oh, animated yeah. something of the year, yeah. Something like that, yeah. I think, I'm not sure though, don't quote me on it's that. Always it been be Dis- it's been Disney it Pixar be, for the past seven been, years. Yeah. But would it, it would technically be Disney though, because they own Marvel, right? No, but well, it's Sony. It, it's also Sony, yeah, it's Sony, Marvel. I know, I see what you're saying, it's Sony though. right I now, saying, though, right? I see what no, you're saying. It's, no, no, it's no, all no, the studios you, working you. together, that's why it was kind of like such an impressive feat. Oh man, okay. Francis in the chat said, I can show title of your sex tape. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, Bimo King of Boo says, Sony got the Spider-Man rights. Yeah, Sony does have the Spider-Man rights, but they did I work gotcha. with a lot of animation studios uh, to, to make the film happen because it took like over 300 uh, animators. Oh, it's just the animators. It was like over 300 people in the crew. And that's like, I think three times more, if not six wow. times more than the, the average animation crew. So it's ridiculous. How much effort went into this movie and you could really see it you could really see the, the effort just the opening credits alone make you go definitely, like Damn. definitely Damn. yeah all right so yeah uh, uh last bit of season renewals news right now star trek discovery is getting one more season on cbs all access so that's a thing i have to admit that's something i really do have to watch i keep seeing the trailers i uh, like like little snippets of it mm-hmm. it looks really cool like it seems for star trek too. The Star Trek Discovery, yeah. I don't know. I, I, I watched into it. I feel like it's my dad's thing. I, man. I just, I, I never watch. Like... I mean, I watched a couple of episodes, but then like, it doesn't seem like, it, like, is season one the same as season two and three? Like, does it have the same feel? Because based on the tr- like the little clips I've been seeing, it seems a lot different. It's it's pretty the same. It's pretty much the same. Yeah. Like, it's it's huh. it's worth a watch in my opinion. Uh, I think. I would recommend like binging like after season two is done is when I would recommend you to binge it. Mm. Yeah, because season two is still going right now, so uh, that's 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 just my recommendation. You can just have at it, like go go for it. But you do have Into the Spider Verse uh, to watch, so yeah, yeah, take your time, take your time. <laughs> um, all right, well, guys, uh, we have other news going on right now. A lot of Pokemon news going on right now. Let's uh, let's let's kick things off with something that happened a little earlier today, actually, which was the Mewtwo Strikes Back Evolution full trailer. So this isn't just a teaser anymore. We got a full trailer going on, uh, and we find out officially that it's it's pretty much a remake of the first Mewtwo Strikes Back movie, but in yeah. 3D CGI. Yeah, the art reminds you of Dragon Prince. I'm just gonna a little bit, just a little bit. Oh really? Not kind of yeah. Just a little bit. Yeah. Just the parts where it's like they try to be 3D. You know what I mean? Like there's certain parts in Dragon Prince where they like you can tell they tried it. Like when the dragon came out. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Yeah. (laughs) I mean, also it's a 30 second trailer still, so I'm I'm still kind of disappointed with the length of this. Honestly, we're gonna get the second one probably. Hopefully. I like that, you know, they actually show Mewtwo Strikes Back. Yes, and then, Mewtwo. Like, Mewtwo is the star of this trailer, and then the other trailer, Mewtwo's... Like, Mewtwo's what? Sorry, Wancho, you cut out for a second. Yeah, Mewtwo is the star bit. of both trailers this week. Oh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. They look, they look almost true, the same, dude. honestly, right? They look almost the same. That, like, uh, the, the, the CG for this mm, Mewtwo, I mean, because the, no. the, the realistic Mewtwo is also smooth and stuff. Oh this, yeah. Well, <laughs> this Mewtwo is smooth. The Charizard's like hella scaly in the, the last Oh yeah. One. Yeah. yeah. That's I true. I mean, I, yeah, I'm just really happy they decided to go 3D animation for this and not like crazy over the top, like trying to do something, you know, with like budget. I'm glad it's kind of like the old style a little bit. You know what I mean? It's still cartoony enough to like, okay, this is like the Pokemon you grew up with. So, yeah. Like at least yeah. for people like older than us that even enjoyed it. We'll be able Dude, to uh, enjoy the movie. I wouldn't mind live action Mewtwo Strikes Back. Really? 
I wouldn't mind. Actually, I wouldn't. Yeah, like if it's I, the same style as yeah. as Detective Pikachu, I wouldn't mind either. Now that you mentioned it, Wancho. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, like, cause I don't know, cause the, the Detective the people, Pikachu though could be the start to mini one. Oh, I know. I I really the, hope so. That, that's, what, that's what I've been saying for the longest time that we're in a Pokemon Renaissance Renaissance right now. Yes. This week just proves it. And it, yes, like. Detective Pikachu just has to go off. Oh, but we're talking about Strikes Back, but this has yeah. to go off, too. Well, let's like, wrap up with Strikes Back. Uh, give me your thoughts on this. Uh, initially, my thought was, man, they're just remaking it. But, like, the fact that it, like, like Derek puts it in a good perspective, you know, if, if they're going to remake it, I'm glad they went all out and didn't cheap out on the remake. And it actually mm -hmm. looks different. You know, it looks visually stunning. And yeah. uh, for me, I think it's great that it's it's something that would hold up today you know like i don't have to go back and rewatch the first me two strikes back and, and think like oh okay it, it's it's 90s animation style like i could actually re watch this and be like ah yeah right <laughs> right yeah. uh the you go ahead first yeah the models for the people though that i feel like that's something <laughs> i have to get used to yeah that, yeah i, mean, I, say this I like, like it. I, I like that nurse joy looks it looks hella pretty in that dress just saying but Okay, bro, calm down. I'm just saying. Just yeah, saying. I know, right? <laughs> no, but when I first saw it, I thought it was claymation. You know, like when because oh. I, I didn't see the trailer first. I saw like people sharing. The yeah, yeah of, I can see the that. Trailers, yeah. and I was like, wait, is this is this play doh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I yeah. The humans that. look kind of play doh -y. Yeah. Yeah. And like, I don't know. The eyes seem weird, except Brock. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> But I, I, I like it. It looks nice. It looks nice, even for if, even if it was they look like Play Doh. Because I wouldn't. I don't know how I would have imagined Ash in 3D animation anyway. So yeah, yeah, that's the truth. Uh, I mean, yeah. Like, let me get a still real quick, just so we could we could further emphasize this a little bit. Yeah, it does look a little Play Dohy, and uh, it's got that mushy looking quality, you know? Yeah, like, right. Uh, yeah. Like all, because all the Pokemon are smooth. Ish, I yeah. Guess, so, I I thought Ash looked, looked darker smooth? too to me. He looks yeah, darker yeah. than he normally does. Yeah. I mean, if he's traveling around the world, he gets tan. Sorry, maybe sense. it's a maybe it's a lowland <laughs> Ash. Yeah. <It's> right. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, man, uh, wait, Bebo Kifu says they look like Figma figures. Oh, that's Francis right. Yeah. Brock uh, spot on. Yeah, Brock is. They got Brad Brackett spot. Well, Nurse Joyce. Good. I like Nurse too. I like Wancho. Okay, okay Brox. Right. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, my thing is, I agreed, Wancho. It's like the Pokemon you're used to seeing them, like you know what I mean, like that yeah. kind of. But he, the people that it's gonna be, yeah, it's gonna take a while to get used to. Yeah. Uh, especially after seeing the still image and like looking at it more for a long period of time, it's just like, <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, e they made it. Uh, <laughs> the the, po the Pokemon models, they've been using 3D models for a really long time already. You no, know? Right, exactly, yeah. right, exactly. Like for Pokemon or the games, but the That's people true. haven't been that 3D. They haven't been this CG. Yeah. Francis said it perfect. It has a Gumby vibe. That is totally Yeah, correct. yeah. Oh, that is Gumby. That's totally correct. That's exactly true. what I've gathered for that. Um, I like that. I like that. And my thing is, too, is like, I really hope they have the same voice actors, but the good thing is, if it's a complete remake, you can literally take the same audio track from the old one and put it... And just, in just lay it over. <laughs> no, I mean, seriously. All they'd have to do is just keep the animation up with the voice. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's really have to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean... Yes. Which is a bad, oh. I don't know. I'd be, I'd be throwing off. It's like... What if, like, Mewtwo was, like, that dark... It's not a dark, menacing voice. It's just like, hi, I'm Mewtwo. You know what I mean? Or something? I don't know. I just really hope they just don't Mewtwo mess up the <laughs> <laughs> voice, like voice acting, and like remakes are very, to me, are very important. It's like it reminds me of like why I loved it in the first place. So if it's like I hear like Ash sounds way different and Misty's, you know. Oh, yeah, that's true. And, and the voice yeah. acting is. I mean, um, yeah. That's yeah, why I mean, Mufasa not, is still Mufasa, aside, right? It's not, <laughs> it's not a spoiler for Wancho, but like in Kingdom Hearts, some of the voice actors weren't there. So oh, uh, okay. It just sucks, but. And, and you know, is, it, is it noticeable? Oh yeah, definitely. Especially on oh. like some of them, like like Kira. Yeah. What? Yeah. 
I just thought of something. I just thought of something. And you, you uh, are we going to get our 90s favorites like M2M back from U2 Strikes Back Evolution? <laughs> Oh, I just want to see Shell Shocker. Okay. Oh my god! He's my favorite. Shell Shocker! Bro, my favorite bro. Ch Ch no, I, <laughs> dude, I, I remember the very first time I watched this movie, I was like, wait, you can ride a Pidgeot? Like, that, I, that was my first oh, thought. Oh man. You know what like, I mean? Because, you know, like yeah. when you're younger, you don't pay attention to like that stuff. You're like, yeah, oh, like Pidgeot involves a Pidgeot, and yeah, and you play the. The video game like when i was younger and i played the game boy i didn't look at the size of pokemon yeah. you know what i mean you're just like it was like red and blue i think too when the first mewtwo came out yeah i yeah. think i could be wrong though it was hard but to like, tell the scale of the pokemon yeah, until you actually like, saw them Pidgeot on screen can, you can ride on Pidgeot. it's sick <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah it's like, it's so crazy. uh yeah. francis said in the chat know. they need to remaster the audio you can't just slap it on because you you need the whole Dol dolby digital that's true yeah, yeah that's true. that makes sense. That makes sense. So, are we gonna get? Don't say you love me. You don't even know me. <laughs> please. Oh my God. Please. I. We need it. We need it. That and a brother. We, we, we need a, my need a brother. Oh dang. <laughs> you know what? Before we like move on from this, I'm just Damn. gonna say. I really hope I don't have to relive one of the saddest moments in my cartoon history movies. Oh. I mean, movies. It has to happen. Yeah, it needs to. Like, uh, there's no, there's no way to get around it. My heart, my heart, there's man. A, there's a reason why they look so squishy right now, so that one of them looks hard <laughs> later. <laughs> Dang it! That sounded what? so weird. <laughs> <laughs> like I knew exactly what you meant, but it's not, right? the delivery was horrible. It was like it's <laughs> right in my head. All right, wait, oh, I'm clipping it. Was... Wait, I have to make a note to clip it for next week's uh, oh promo. Oh my god! One dude. second. Like, Wait, I knew sec. exactly what he was talking about, but, like... What episode are we on? This is episode 85. 85. Episode 85. 37-minute oh mark. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God, man. That's so funny. I can't even... That's hilarious, man. Uh... have to make it See, I'm right? that just reminds me. Like, see, honestly... Yeah, I did. I did. I got it. But it was just, like, when I heard it come out of your mouth, I was like, uh... <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. You're not making uh, it better. <laughs> I'm, not, yeah, I'm, just, I'm, I'm not gonna stop. I'm done. So, to the next right. Pokemon trailer. Hey, sorry. Thanks yeah, for so, tuning in. Thanks for tuning <laughs> yeah. in. So, wait, we'll move on in a second. I also, uh, that's, this is one legit question I also have. Do you think they'll also do Pikachu's Vacation remastered like this, or are they just gonna skip that and go straight that to That would games? be cool. They better do that now that you say that. Cause like, yeah, because yeah, that, like, that's like the first time you see Don Fan and I think Meryl. Yeah. So like, yeah. And Snubble. Right? And Snubble. And Snubble. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. And then you like, find snap. out. Like, okay. People are like, stop, 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 stop. Yeah, I remember yeah. that. <laughs> we were like, who is that? What is that Pokemon? <laughs> oh. I need I just, some like, of that. I my childhood for like two <laughs> seconds. Dang. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That was, wow. That's a good quote. Yeah. Wow. Okay. They, they should put that in. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Next right trailer we got. Right. That. Uh, we're, that. we're sticking with the po Oh yeah, right. Oh, we're sticking with the Pokemon theme, and we got the second trailer for Detective Pikachu. Yeah. Man, like the more I see this, like the more I, I just wanna, I wanna, I wanna get it already. Cause like, I, I know we're getting it in May. I know we're getting it in a couple months. Uh, Fanime would be a good time want to to have this happening as well, but uh. I just the more I see the Pokemon, like the like Ludicolo, man. This, this, you know, little, <laughs> God, I remember that part. How I just started bursting with laughter? I'm, oh my God. God, I'm just worried. I'm just worried they didn't, you know, reveal everything already with the two. I think they I, I hope so too. I hope they. I hope they didn't. But is it just me though? Can I just say, like, man, Pikachu is so freaking cute, regardless of <laughs> Ryan Reynolds. But you know what I mean? It has like, like you just look at Peach like, man, it's still, it looks really cute. Even though it's like kind of weird to hear Ryan Reynolds' voice, like not really. It, it works is what I'm trying to say. It yeah. works. It, like, it's still the cute Pikachu, man, that you always like know. Yeah, you I can mean, mute it. You can mute it and it'd still be hell of like, you know, you, it's something you'd want. I mean, Ryan right. Reynolds is, is cute. 
Let's pick up, pick up. Yeah, he was like, pick up, pick up. Okay, I will say though, honestly, like, I want to start off with a con just because I don't, like, I really love this trailer and it's not, like, I'm not saying I hate it. I don't okay, know go. if I'm a huge fan of how much hair they put on some of these Pokemon for some reason. Oh, like the free. Pikachu is okay. Right. But, like, some of them, it looks like insane. Like, Snubble has hair. Like, that's just kind of weird to me. I mean, a oh. dog. I know. I, I get. I know what it is. But like, like Pikachu is a mouse Pokemon. I know they're trying to be realistic, but it's like in the game, I always oh, thought of Gramble or sorry, Gramble. Snubble has like glossy type, mm. like skin. Oh, I mean, like yeah. When when you think of a pit bull, you don't think they're super furry. I get it. I get yeah, what you mean. That's true. Yeah. Right. Did, you know what I mean. The Flareon though. The Flareon. Yeah. Wait, Flareon. Yeah, so you're talking I'm, about, I'm gonna look for that it. I'm gonna look for sense. all these. Like, like that makes sense because it's like it's literally a fire dog. Well, like. Some Pokemon, I feel like Snubble's they just have literally to put... a dog. I know, but <laughs> but like okay, but Flareon always looks like it's fluffy. not even it's not even a fire like... dog. It's literally a dog dog. A <laughs> dog but dog. Flareon, but Flareon looks fluffy in the game. Snubble or Gran. Damn it! I keep saying Gramble. Snubble. <laughs> I don't looks blame like... you. Like, see, Gramble looks like a rock, dude. Like it looks like he's made of rock. And then Snubble, Snubble looks like at least like Mewtwo type skin almost. That's yeah. what I always imagined, anyways. Yeah, Can't find yeah I don't know. Like, see, even Lickitung, they got that right. Like, I saw Lickitung, I'm like, oh, I feel like that's yeah. skin wise look like. They could have done that for Grand. Oh, God, oh someone I didn't expect to have like hair, I guess, would be Jigglypuff. But it works. Oh, it works though. It works. Look at these it freaking works. Growlithe. Look at the Growlithe. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Look, yeah. Oh, so dude, excited. look at the back left. There's a huge Arcanine. Like, the, the I didn't even notice that the right. Golem. What's his name again? I didn't notice yeah, it until right now. Go Are yeah. those Reggie Rocks? Oh, those Reggie Rocks? Rocks. No, no. It's no, not no, Charmander. No. It's Squirtle. It's, no, no. It's the ghost. The ghost fighting. Gullert. Oh, my God. No. Gullert. Gullert. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. There's so I much in this. That. I lost it. Oh, my God. Wait, look That's at the crazy. back right. Charmander's look at the back butt. right. Next to the <laughs> next to the cop car, up. it's another Arcanine. Like, yeah, there's, there's so Arcanine. much. Oh, it's an actual Arcanine. What? A, oh my god. Okay, I'm literally wow. gonna pause every frame later. We and need just, this. Like, if I can see like a little. See, okay, that's another one. John, I never John imagined Rangers Snorlax so with cute. hair, dude. John, okay, like, yeah. Snorlax, look at that. That bothered me. I never imagined Snorlax with hair. I imagined a uh, big rubbery dude. Okay, yeah. I mean, he's, you know I guess I mean? he's kind of based on a bear as well. Like, there's stuff okay, that we're going to have to get used to. Yeah, there's going to have to but that's yeah. way too much. Like, maybe like it's a suede. Much. Like, suede like maybe, type hair. Maybe leave the you know? belly and the face think... hairless. No, dude, I think it fits. I don't... You think? You think? Yeah, I think yeah. it fits. I mean, don't get me wrong. I would love to hug that thing. But, like, <laughs> it's just... I mean, imagine if it was, uh... like, if, it was, if they animated Snorlax, like how they animated Machamp. It would look weird. Oh, yeah. That'd be a little weird. Would, that'd be, that'd would, be too realistic. rubbery. I just love how much champ is like the police, like, or guy. <laughs> He's like, hey. So, no, like, okay, so oh, that's the thing, right? Champ. Yeah, there's a pan champ in oh the back. Oh my god, there is! Dude, we're fighting <laughs> We're just gonna geek out over every frame. Oh my there's god. There's Jiggy Puff so in the very right, the very right. Okay, like a little bit above <laughs> and to the right of the pan champ. What is that? Like on the, on the red. Red uh, we're bus gonna, stop. We're gonna figure this out, dude. Is that a Domino's? Oh, what is that? <laughs> yeah. A Domino's. Oh, Look at that. the picture it of Jolteon, is... though, on the right. Above, like, and the, it's just a picture of Jolteon. Oh, yeah. Oh, what is that? Yeah, you're right. Like a store sign. What is that? Like, yeah, is. the other one. Is that Ambipom, maybe? It just looks funny? Oh, it might oh, be. Smoochum? Oh, God. Why am I... What is wrong with me tonight? I keep saying that oh, evolution. Mm -hmm. instead of the root. That's fine. Emolga? Uh, I don't think it... I don't think it's in Mulga. That's a close guess, though. You, like, you know, you know this this like be. this movie is super well made just because we're not catching the Pokemon right away. They don't stick out. Yeah, right? exactly. Yeah. Like it actually fits in the world. Man, right? see, like I, oh my gosh, there's gonna be like this whole movie, kind of like how people do it with Into the Spider Verse. Like this whole movie is gonna be something you could just like freeze frame with friends and like just play who's that Pokemon. Ooh. Yeah, that's that's actually true. Next frame, next frame. Oh. Next yeah, frame. Next frame. <laughs> <laughs> Bob Black, thank you for the emoga. I just saw that now. I didn't. 
I did notice oh the God. Weedle in that one. I didn't that see one. the Emolga. The Weedle. Yeah, he's saying that's probably what the Damn other it. thing is on the Damn on top Francis. of it. When you think uh, of people, you don't think of you don't think of Africa. Jeez. Oh my God! <laughs> Liz, see, like the the it, look at the joy we're getting from the trailers, and like imagine we're getting like an hour and a half of this. Right. We could do one whole special on stream of just going through these frames and the act when the movie releases digitally, and I would be happy. Yeah. I'd be so yeah. happy. There's just so much in this. This movie would make me happy for just the little things. Like, if you saw, like, in a little pond, like a sunskirt, just, just you know, just like... Oh, man. Just little things like that. Like, I think it's kind of like in Harry Potter, dude. Like, Wait. you know what I mean? You all know the world of Harry Potter, but it's like those little tiny things yeah. that make you feel like the world is bigger. It's just yes. like, that's the best thing. The loud red, that, that, that part was hilarious. They're like the bass for like... <laughs> yeah. I, I'm so sorry to the audio only listeners. I realize we're geeking over something that they don't see. But... Oh, I'm sorry. That, no, but that just proves how... I think what I'm getting from this right now is this movie is going to be so rewatchable on so many levels. You know, it's going to be oh, yeah. so rewatchable for different things. And you could end up hating the entire plot and, and the story. But you could still go back and do this and just appreciate the fact that each of these Pokemon are on screen. And they <laughs> look hilarious. And some of them look adorable and so good. Yeah, Ludicolo, yeah, man. That right? Ludicolo is super Ludicolo, well. like, man, that was, that was the bomb. The <laughs> 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 that, was funny, that part was hilarious, man. Oh, yeah, man. see that? And, no, the Blastoise fighting the Gengar, I thought that was sick. Oh, yeah. Like the Gengar that did like a mirror, mirror image kind of thing. Oh, no, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah. That, that. It was like the Gengar was like, you know, popping out. Yeah, and the loud ones are all in the back next to the deep. There's like see, so many that, more. See, look, look. Look very carefully. It looks like Gengar has hair, and that would bother me because he's a ghost. <laughs> I'm sure he doesn't. Ghost he should be a shader. Have you ever seen a ghost? Buddy? Ghosts can have hair. Not a Gengar, huh? <laughs> oh, man, I just realized. Man. I realized that uh, behind the Flareon, I'm trying to look for it, was, was like Palkia statues. Uh, a Palkia what? statue and uh, the yeah. other one. Uh, what's up? Dialga. Dialga, yeah. Like, there's, there's oh, so much whoa. to this. And you see Arceus right behind him, too. Like, there's so much. There's so much. He's coming out of the Arceus thing, right? I don't know what's going on, but it's oh, so it's good. The creator of all Pokemon. That's where they're creating the Pokemon. It makes sense. Or he just evolved, like. <laughs> Illuminati Arceus confirms. <laughs> oh, I think he just evolved. No, I think he came out of the Pokeball. Oh, okay, that, that, that's blue. possible. There's, Actually, so good, there's so much wait, good wait. stuff in this. Is that is that the that's the chick from Jane the Virgin, right? I think so. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. No, the evolution though, I could see an evolution instead. It doesn't look like a Pokemon. Man, yeah, there's, there's there's so much in this trailer. If you haven't seen it yet. And, or if you have seen it and you don't like it, oh, I suggest exactly doing this game. with your friends and just stopping the frame and oh, like, geeking also, out. Poke floats. Poke floats, yes, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. And I, but, we, oh. we totally missed out on the thing that we're supposed to be talking about right now and the fact that Mewtwo is in this new trailer out of nowhere. Oh yeah. Out of yeah. nowhere. Because like we yeah. weren't really expecting him. We were expecting this to be like an introduction to the Pokemon world. Yeah. Uh... I, I honestly didn't expect any legendaries at all. I thought we'd establish like, okay, you're you're in a living, breathing world. They nod to the legendaries like with the Dialga and the Pocket, but we're actually yeah. seeing Mewtwo. How much we're gonna see of him is yeah, I'm, I'm, up in the air. I'm I'm super surprised by that too, because normally what Pokemon do in movies, they center the plot around the legendary Pokemon, like Mewtwo yeah. strikes back, right? Yeah, so, yeah. If Mewtwo's in this, but then it's still Detective Pikachu. What I'm getting from this is Mewtwo's there, but then we're trying to find out why Pikachu is Pikachu, or why he can that's, talk, yeah. or wh where's the dance. That's, like, that's true, yeah, why he can understand him. Which is kind of what they alluded to earlier on in the trailer. It's like, uh, yeah, he just woke up yeah. as a Pikachu. Ryan Reynolds just woke up as a Pikachu. Uh, the, I, I love how committed he is to this, because he also had like a little behind the scenes thing where he made fun of how he, he had to become Pikachu. To do the role uh but but talking about this trailer specifically again i have you guys seen the japanese version because i i remember reading oh, about it I, I never oh, really watched it 
No, like the it's... the original was a Japanese Detective Pikachu. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if it was. It might have been a movie. Could someone then, correct me on and that? Then, and then and then the Pikachu's voice was super deep. Oh my gosh. And then, and then people were like, oh, so when, when they put it in America, is they're going to make, like, Danny DeVito Pikachu? Oh. <laughs> really? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I, you know what, though? I'm going to say something first before the, we move on from the Mewtwo thing. I honestly go, go. think they shouldn't have showed that. Yeah. Just imagine if you were in Me the too. movie and that happened, you would freak out. And that would oh, just yeah. add to the element of why you like yeah. him. Like, oh my god, yeah. Mewtwo pop. So I'm really hoping there's that, something that, that, else that's going to happen. That's why I'm scared. Like, if they showed everything already. Yeah. They showed all the Pokemon. I want to go into it and go like, oh, thing. That's, a, that's another Pokemon. Yeah, I know. I don't want all sure... of it to just be in the trailer already. Yeah. No, that's true. Because like, I'm pretty sure they didn't need Mewtwo to, to get people into the cinemas. Because the, the nostalgia alone would probably drive them in. Right. But do you think yeah. that they were that scared, seeing maybe? Mewtwo... Yeah, yeah, right. Like they, they might have been a little hesitant, like worried that okay, we might not get as many people in the cinemas. That might be it, right? Or maybe they were thinking, okay, they're they're those fans that might not want to watch it because they're purists. Maybe Mewtwo will push them over the edge. But I, I, I'm kind of with you guys <clears throat> that it would have been better for the people who actually watched it to freak out when they saw Mewtwo in the movie. Yeah. I, I know. Mean, it I like it would have been better, but this is smart just because you know there's another trailer about Mewtwo already. Yeah, kind of that's true. Yeah, yeah. marketing wise, it's kind of yeah. smart. This is smart. Yeah. It's just would have been better for us. <laughs> yeah, my thing is too. It's like you almost analyze it. Like he came out of the float, and Pikachu was like jumping, so maybe he's worth running away from you too. Oh, you, you want to go into theory time? You want to? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> wanna... oh, who's who's gonna, gonna die? In... Is Mewtwo the one that's like linking the mind of? The guy talking oh, to Pikachu, that's why he can hear him. That's why they can talk to each other. Cause yeah, because that's how Mewtwo like, talk. Like, Mewtwo, what the hell did you say? Mewtwo. Mewtwo, mofo. That's how he talks. That's how he talks to you know in the in Mewtwo Strikes Back with his mind. Also, Mario yeah. did that same thing. Because we saw Mewtwo, it gives me hope that Team Rocket is the bad guy. Yeah, I hope uh, so, man. I swear, in all the detective ones, right? Like, weren't they still the bad Welcome people? to the Pokemon Direct. I have, I have, I have in the games? I thought, I, I I thought it was. I could be wrong. Stuff. But Mewtwo is always, like, you know, he's always... He was created by Team Rocket, so... We saw the... Yeah, right, that's true. Giovanni, man. And stuff. Yeah, Giovanni, man. And, <laughs> I mean, like, Giovanni himself, he looks like a crime lord. So, he, he, fits, yeah. he fits in perfectly in Detective Pikachu. Uh, I guess one I mean, thing yeah, I'm really it, hoping to... Oh, no, go, you go ahead. No, no, I was just going to say, like, I, I can see them working in, like, Team Rocket as the villains, and, like, because it is a mystery movie, right? Yeah, so, sorry, go on, yeah, watch it. That, that, that would have been our, our, whoa, it's them moment. Yeah, know? yeah. Uh, yeah, I, I, I just wanted... I was just going to say the, the one thing I'm looking forward to seeing in the movie, though, is Pokemon League. Because that they haven't oh. shown that in the trailer. Oh... I wanted, like, you know how in the cartoons, it's always grand. It's, like, in a giant stadium, and there's, like, two people. Yeah. Just thing. They showed a cage fight. I hope that's not the Pokemon League. <laughs> yeah, no, <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure. I'm like, pretty that, sure that since it's, like, like a noir thing. thing. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. That's, that's, yeah. A, that's definitely going to be an underground thing. You don't get DJs like that in the Pokemon League, Wancho. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> but, yeah, I, that's what I'm excited to see especially, especially they showed the ticket to the pokemon league too right oh yeah yeah like oh i have a i have a quick question oh my god dude i'm sorry i was just like trying to look to the bad guy was in detective pikachu yeah and literally this game that i'm reading sounds exactly like what was happening in the trailer so i'm not gonna read it anymore uh -huh. Ooh, okay yeah, stop stop yourself <laughs> yeah i don't want to spoil yourself. myself yeah i was like okay because oh, yeah. we got uh, okay. we got like how how much longer do we have? Like a month, uh, two months, and two months. and some change. Two months and some change. Dude, yeah, and a lot of movies are gonna, gonna be rolling, so it's gonna be like a good, like you know what I mean. Like Captain Marvel's coming, then you have Avengers coming, and then Pikachu's coming. Yeah, oh, and this Pikachu so comes crazy, before man. Avengers, right? No, no, Avengers and no, then no, Pikachu. No, no, I think after. It's, I think I think Pikachu's yeah. after, right? Yeah, dude, Pikachu. we are so yeah, lucky. Yeah. We are so lucky. I know. We're getting a good like three straight God. months of. If he could only watch one movie for 2019, what would it be? No, don't do this to me, no. Poncho. Don't do this to me. No. Oh, man. 
Spider Verse is part of this too because we haven't seen it yet, Derek. Oh snap! <laughs> no, Spider Verse is technically 2018. Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. Phew. Phew. I still think I would. Phew. I still think I would pick Endgame. Oh man, yeah. Just because of what happened in the first one, if it was like you got to that, know that crazy. Yeah. You Honestly, got to I know how it ends. So much, it would be this. You Ooh. know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna gamble. I'm gonna say Star Wars. Chaos ain't even out yet. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. The chair's not even out, but it's I, I, coming out in December, obviously, right? I hope you're ready for one of the darkest Star Wars ever. <laughs> Watch them fight on Pepper this time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Oh my god, dude. I know that God, that thing always haunts me to this day. The darkest Star Wars. Oh my ever. god. No. It tastes way. like salt! They, they make the logo red. Because of salt. Yeah, I know. <laughs> or did they make the salt red because of the logo? Because of the logo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh or my god. Either the, way, it's bad. Metaphorically, oh god. Show. I was in my happy place. Like, I was in my happy place. Red Why did you have to sit. take me there? <laughs> Keep going crazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm excited for Detective Pikachu way more than I was before talking about it because. <laughs> yeah, a, a lot of my 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 emotions have been built in the past few minutes of uh, <laughs> Detective Pikachu yeah. and the potential of yeah. you know live action Pokemon movies. I hope this is a success because even if yeah, it'll be sto even if it's gonna be terrible story wise, which it, it might not be, I just want more live action Pokemon. That's that's yeah. I just want more. Yeah, I want more. Oh, it's a stepping stone, right? Yeah, exactly. Yes, exactly. All right, uh, to round off for Pokemon news. Pokemon Direct happened for seven minutes two nights ago, uh, and it was good! It was good! We found out uh, that it was going to be called Pokemon Sword. The next generation of Pokemon games for the Nintendo Switch is going to be called Pokemon Sword and Shield. We couldn't not talk about it because of all the Pokemon news that we've had this week. And I wanted to throw it in here because I know Wancho and Derek are Pokemon fans. Derek streams Let's Go on Twitch.tv slash Sensei Humor. Shameless plug. So we, we, we needed to we needed to brush up on this because we've talked about Detective Pikachu on Game Bite, so we might as well talk about Sword and Shield on the Geek Cast. Okay, fair, 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 fair. Fair. Let's some topics. Fair. Yeah. Okay, and, you know uh, what? I just spoiler right now. Pokemon Sword is Doughblade. Pokemon Shield is Aegis Lab. There you go. I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know, they they they're legendary evolutions. No, but yeah. Uh. So. Yeah. Right. So, guys, thoughts on Sword and Shield and the whole reveal thing? You know, I'll, I'll go like, first. This watch will probably have a lot to say. I'm just yeah. my. Okay. I, I I think it's good. I, I'm excited. Um, I love the new starters. Uh, I play every Pokemon game with a water starter, so I'm definitely getting Sobble. Dang, uh, I, I, getting I never I never not choose the water. It's just I just water is my favorite type of yeah. like Pokemon, which is weird, but it's weird because my favorite Pokemon is not water type, but. <laughs> Um, yeah, it's just, I, I, it's so exciting because it's a new generation, man. And it's like, I like it because from started with Let's Go Pikachu. It's like a new generation of Pokemon. This is our, yeah, the eighth. not our kid. You don't have kids, but this is like, or Huancho does, but this is like their version of our Game Boy Red and Blue. Like, Let's Go uh, was. And now this, yeah, some... this could be like, yeah, they gotta, I mean, they obviously gotta be careful, man. It's really hard to come with new Pokemon every, you know, anyways. But I'm really yeah. excited, man. New things are always cool. Like, I had my ifs about, um, what's, what was the, God, oh my God, Sun and Moon. But yeah. it was fun, dude. It was a great game. So, I mean, I, I can't wait to see what Generation 8 holds. Um, it looks really awesome. And I think it's, from what Wancho told me, it looks like it's based in the UK. That's cool. And you can change yeah. your outfit more. I like that. Scottish. Yeah. But, uh. Oh yeah, I mean, it looks really fun. I can't wait to play it. Uh, what do you? How are you, Wancho? What do you, what do you, what do you uh, before we get to Wancho, because I, I I really do want to find out Wancho's uh, points on this. Uh, he's really ready to burst. Uh, but 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 Derek said something that kind of makes me think, because since it is, we are kind of twenty years removed from the initial Pokemon buzz. It is the perfect time for them to re-release Mewtwo Strikes Back. Oh yeah, actually yeah. Right, like kids who weren't born yet back then, like yeah. It's, it's yeah, their time. Yeah, it's actually true. It is true. Huh. Yeah. That's, I didn't realize the correlation. Now. That makes total really, sense. Really yeah, that makes total sense. All right. Wancho, man. Thoughts on Sword and Shield. No, yeah. So, uh, 
I, I just super agree with what Derek said about how this is going to be a lot of people's first Pokemon. Because, well, first main generation Pokemon game. Yeah, yep. Because you don't understand how many stars had to align, oh, how many stars aligned for this. So there's Pokemon Go, the Pokemon Go hype. So there's everyone who played Pokemon Go or and still continue to play it is going to, and plays this game is going to be their first, first main gen game. There's going to be the people, I guess, if people who watch Detective Pikachu or something like that, or yeah. you two who get introduced yeah. to it by, by via that. Then there's also the fact that the Nintendo Switch is one of the best selling hey, consoles. M- of move closer time. to the mic. Move closer to the mic. <clears throat> so yeah, there's the Nintendo Switch. You know, the Nintendo Switch is one of the best selling consoles of all time, yeah. right? It's it sold like hotcakes. So a bunch of people have the have have access to this. Yeah. So this game has to be good, like. Literally, Pokemon Renaissance is happening. So yeah, and yeah, this has to be good. And I honestly, they picked the perfect region, UK. Dude, I, I didn't realize it was UK until because all the hype was on the starters. I'm also gonna pick the water. Yeah, really cute. <laughs> yeah, but, man. Like UK or. That area is always has always been good for role playing games, you know. Like, mm-hmm. it's called Sword and Shield, and we're in the UK. You just know we're gonna fight like a huge dragon, right? There's gonna be a huge yeah. dragon Pokemon or some kind of like that kind of mystery. So you get a yeah, get a different I, evolution for that Mastiff uh, Scotty uh, Pokemon. I'm hi- I mean, they they showed the, like part of the map too is a giant lake, and there's a sword. Yeah! So. Arthurian uh, legends. There's, there's yeah, I know they're always the Pokemon. Always follows legends, dude. Like yeah. Arceus yeah. and and I'm oh, not sorry, Arce- Xerneas and the eagle. That was like the Nordic thing, right? Uh, oh, was it? I, I yeah, like I think the, Xerneas represented the yeah, tree Xerneas, or something like that. Yeah, Xerneas is the tree, and then and the eagle is the one that the, like, watches Zygarde it. Zygarde is the serpent under. Oh, the Zy- tree. yep, 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 exactly. And then. There was a bird that like watched, I think, yeah, or something yeah, like an eagle or something, eagle, and that was supposed yeah. to be, um, so, so or evil, evil. Yeah, evil. And, yeah, yeah, definitely. But you yeah. can pull out so much stuff from. Arthur oh yeah, man. So yeah, it's oh, great. Man. It's it, great. Yeah, it's gonna be good. Uh, I'm pretty hyped <laughs> for this. For I'm the sorry, uh, for Francis the... said something really funny. He yeah, said, it... you're fighting the queen of the <laughs> Pokemon League. <laughs> That'd be so funny. <laughs> they make like a corgi Pokemon, dude. That'd be so oh, hilarious. Man. Yeah, the memes are are rabid on online, and I'm, I'm loving really? it. I'm loving it. Uh, Francis in the chat actually has a question. He says, "Tossing a rabbit hole topic. Rabbit hole topic. Ooh, do you fun. think? Do you think Score Bunny will be fire slash fighting? <laughs> no, could be fire. Lightning. I mean." Ooh. That was yeah, sick. Is, is he's it, he's the he's Energizer already... Bunny. I'm yeah. Like, oh, oh that's damn. A... Firefighting is too. It can't be firefighting anymore. Because it was Blaziken, Again, yeah. her name, and, and the, the pink. I forget. Embor. Tepping. Uh, Embor, yeah. No I more. think uh, ba- Sobble's going to be Water Fairy. Mm. They, they just did that. Did they really? Oh, you're right. You're dragon. right. Water Ooh. Dragon. No, yeah, he could be like a OP chameleon type. that becomes a dragon, yeah, kind of like they have water a water steel Charizard. Already. He's probably just going to yeah. be water, dude. For some reason, there's so many where they're just, just water. Maybe oh, the yeah. final evolution will be the the changing. They did that for a... Um, who was that? One of the generations was like that, where they had like water, water, and then it was like water something, and then grass something at the end. Was it Greninja? Oh, that, I think... I think he was dark at the second evolution. I can't remember though. I can't. Yeah, Greninja is dark. Okay. But he Water wasn't. Dark. But he wasn't dark through the other ones, right? It was just. Yeah, the no, end. he's not. He's just yeah, a frogadier. Wasn't wasn't dark yet. Yeah, yeah, that was the one. That was the one. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, yeah. Uh, this looks great. The fashion is definitely going to be better because you know cold weather, uh, fashion is always more expressive than than hot weather fashion, <laughs> as as I yeah. would know from living in the Philippines and. Looking desperately for air conditioning so I could wear more layers. Uh, yeah, so good stuff. Uh, Mirage Leonardo in the chat uh, says, Pokemon Sun and Shield should be the name of a Fire Emblem X Pokemon crossover. 
Oh, sword and shield. Oh, yeah. That would be fun. That would be... So, it could still happen. It could still happen. What if they made, like, like a fighting system like that in Pokemon? Where you just, like, oh. actually move out? That would be kind of cool. Dude, I, I've been I've been wanting a game like that. I've been wanting a game like that. You mean Pokemon? No, no, as no, in, like, like, you still Fire play, Emblem, like, like, it'd still be Pokemon, but then, like, the actual Pokemon Fire fighting Emblem. mechanics would be, wouldn't just be turn-based. You do know there was a crossover between Pokemon and Pokemon, right? No, there wasn't. Oh, no, not Fire Emblem. It was something else, sorry. Pokemon and... I forget. You'll get there, you'll get there. Fire Emblem. There was a crossover, though? I didn't know that. I don't know. Now yeah, I'm kind of curious. And... Yeah, Wancho will look for it. Wancho will look for it. Uh... Conquest? Pokemon Conquest? Was there? Conquest. Yeah, Conquest. What was that? That's what Mirage Leonardo just said it in the chat. He said, There we dope. go. Thank you. Okay, Thank I've you, never Mirage heard of this. Leonardo. I gotta look it up now. And... Play now. I'm just kidding. <laughs> it looks like Fire Emblem. F Fire Emblem? M Fire Emblem. Fire Emblem. <laughs> Damn, that looks not nasty, yeah, it dude. Looks really nice. Look at the right. black ray quaza, dude. You look sick. Wait, what? Let me throw this up on screen. Why have I oh, never seen on. this game? Yeah, and then that's the fight system. The the fire emblem fight system. Wait right. a second. What? Wait a... I've never heard of this. Ever. Where was the the uh yeah, exactly there was no for this game? Because it was on the it was DS. On the DS. Oh. I remember seeing this, and then I, there we I, go. I had Perfect. A hard time finding this game, actually. I haven't played it. But you know what? Funny, you... the good games are the ones you walk into the store like this game looks good. I'm gonna play it. Yeah, that's what you yeah, don't get right. anymore, right? I know. Man, that's impossible. That's impossible now. Yeah. I know. I know. Every time true. before you buy a game, you always have to check the reviews. Yeah, 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 but yeah, we never yeah. found out about this. Oh well, the DS was kind of a little bit. I know, before. I've never heard about this I, either. I mean, I, I knew about it. Oh my, Francis, Francis says it's, said it's FF. Yeah, right, right. I was reading uh, the same thing. Wow. So I guess Francis and both Mirage Leonardo would recommend this. Man, how? We we need to review this somehow. <laughs> can this? Can I download this on the Switch? Is there an I... emulator version? <laughs> Dude, there's like Pokemon to characters. That looks so cool. Man, Pokemon. Okay, we'll, we'll look this what? up after because now. The, the, do you see the samurai we're... with the Articuno? Yeah, uh, that looks uh, sick. That's why I was like, "What?" Team Mystic and... every day, all day. Uh, uh. IGN has a review <laughs> as well. I'll look. I'll look up the reviews later. Man, Pokemon, you know guys. What? It, Wancho's Pokemon Keep Renaissance going. theory is. Yeah, like, I have to do something. Keep going. Yeah, go, go Sensei. Go Sensei. <laughs> go. Go Sensei. Go Sensei. Go. But yeah. Ancho man, like, oh, this is this is really interesting. Mm -hmm. I mean, see, because Pokemon wasn't super hyped for like 2012, you didn't hear about this game. But yeah. Now, if they release something odd like Detective Pikachu again, okay. yeah, like on the Switch, no, for you're real. Hear about it I'm now, back. right? Because oh, yeah, sorry. because of the Pokemon Renaissance. Yeah. For real. No, like, and I, yeah, like, honestly, like, if the, like when th this did come out, I wasn't. God damn it, Derek. You you interrupted us just to change into a hoodie. <laughs> I know, right? What? Oh, sorry. I... What? Oh, man. <laughs> Dang it. Oh, man. oh, Francis in the chat says he has a physical copy that I can borrow. It runs on the 3DS. <gasps> Dang it. Mail it to me when you're done, please. Thank you. <laughs> 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 Fra right Franc here. Francis will never get it back because when Wancho gets here, I'll be done and then I'll hand it to Wancho yeah. and then Wancho will hand yeah. it to Derek. I'm ready to go all time. Hey, real quick though, me Mirage Leonardo 80 says, imagine mm. if they made a horror horror mod for Pokemon Snap but made it fail oh. frame. That's oh. something I don't want to see. I don't want that one. No. Dude, it's, I mean, it's, it's mostly going to be like Dust Skulls and Ghastlies, right? <laughs> Ghastly, yeah. Just his tongue like, ah. Just like, <laughs> that would be so Dude, I feel like if you like, I've always thought if you saw like Haunter or Gengar in like real life, that'd be scary, dude. That'd be terrifying. They just is like kind of like scary. Like Gengar, I think it was something like he hops in people's dreams and gives them nightmares yeah. or something like that. Yeah, dude, he's Haunter like dream literally. Dream. He's Terrible. the uh, he's the uh, uh, Edward Scissorhands. No, no, he's the. Uh, Jesus, Nightmare Fred, on Elm Freddy Street, Kruger. basically. Freddy, Freddy Kruger. God, I can't. Edward Scissorhands. <laughs> 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 
He's a Freddy Krueger of Pokemon. <laughs> I'm like, what? Yeah. No. God. You don't know, you know there's actually a Pokemon with scissors for hands. Called Scissors. Oh, the. Uh, yeah, the freaking mole. Edward. Yeah, the mole. Scissor! Oh, yeah! Si <laughs> Scizor. Yeah. Scizor. Yeah. So, yeah. I think. Wait, I think can I ask you all something first? Oh. Go, bro. Go. I, I'm having Nelson Mandela effect. Okay. I always. Say I'm pretty sure it's just the Mandela so effect. I know, I know, I know. But I always. <laughs> anyway, listen. Okay. Um. I swear this happened. Okay. No one believes me, and I want to see if maybe you two remember or chat, please. Okay. So when Ash had a pincer, okay. This is not. I've told someone to a couple times. They don't have this as a thing in the Pokemon, like, world. But I swear to God, there was an episode where Pinsir evolved into Heracross. No. I'm not uh. kidding, dude. I swear it happened. Someone in chat, please, like, just it feels verify. Like, like, I mean, like, it I feels like one of those things. Pinsir, and it, like, opened and turned into the, the thing. I swear, because Ash had a Pinsir, and then he had Heracross, right? I feel it like one of, yeah. I feel like I feel it's like... one of those things that you talk about with your, like, grade school mates, and then, like, you imagine it so vividly. I, I feel like it's one of the... I feel like it's one of the... You probably just dreamt it, dude. Like, Edward Scissorhands implanted Shut that. Up. No, but, you know, okay, Ash, you know, okay, for sure you know that Ash had a pincer, right? For sure he had a pincer. No, he... Yes, first he generation had... he had a pincer. No, and he, had he had also had a hair across. But he just had a hair across. <laughs> It evolved. I'm telling you. <laughs> They're trying to trick us, you guys. Pinsir evolves <laughs> the Heracross. I just, just it, it's true, man. And Pinsir is like, like a stag beetle. Not stag, it's like Pinsir beetle. And he turned into a stag. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> You're we'll, all we'll today proof. years old when you found could, this out. <laughs> it could be deleted footage that, that Sensei Humor might find in the future yeah. and prove us all yeah. wrong. I'm going to find yeah. it. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> the next show's goal is to find that, I swear. Oh my gosh. Uh, Mirage Leonardo says he has some gaming news. The Escapist Complete Edition is getting a physical release for Switch through Limited Run Games today. That's awesome, dude. That's awesome. Nice. I should talk about that on Game Bite. You can check out Game Bite, our gaming podcast, Mirage Leonardo. It's Game Bite with a Y T E. Uh, oh, you it's on Spotify. Right here or you, get, you just keep keep it here on the clips on geekcast we have mo we have two podcasts yeah. on the network uh, and and yeah. a bunch of other shows oh yeah we'll talk about the otaku cast after this uh but yeah so pokemon guys it, it's i can't wait to talk more pokemon when the movie's out because i want to i want to go through it i want to just dissect everything it's gonna be so fun it's gonna be so fun that's true you probably All talk right. about it in the otaku cast right oh dude dude <laughs> Where, where, where does it fall? Where does it fall? Where, where does it fall? It's fall. It's fall. It's fall. <laughs> All right. All right. Well, uh, guys, you're familiar with that 70s show, right? Oh, yeah. You guys love, uh, you guys know yourself some Eric Foreman, uh, Topher <laughs> Grace. Venom? The guy who played Venom. Oh, my oh, we gosh. We both said it. We both said it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah. Well, we don't speak about that, Venom. Uh, but. <laughs> But we can't talk about Topher Grace and his love for Star Wars. Apparently, the guy is is just hella in love with Star Wars because, uh, you know, he kind of, quote-unquote, grew up with Star Wars when he was on that 70s show. There's a whole uh, Rebel Force Radio, which is another podcast, uh, one of the best Star Wars podcasts, probably the best Star Wars podcast out there, Rebel Force Radio. Uh, and... They, they had an interview with him talking about his love for Star Wars recently. It, it was it was released like two, three days ago, uh, which is hot on the heels of him releasing a five minute trailer that he cut himself with his friend. And it, and the trailer involves all of the Star Wars movies that have been released to date, and it's a pretty yeah. badass video. I shared it no, on the Quit Stalling Facebook page, and I retweeted it on the Quit Stalling Twitter. I think I even linked it on 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 our Discord in in the general. If you guys haven't yet, check it out. It's pretty good, and it really shows the passion and love he has for for Star Wars. Uh, have you guys had the chance to watch this? Yes, I saw it's, 
my thing is like, man, it's just like, and I love it. I'm like, it's nostalgic, man. It's like one of those things you watch. It's like the first time I watched the first trailer for Seven. Like, kind of. Like, you know when you watch Seven and you're like, oh my god, it's coming back. It's so just wait, like... Wait till you see the, the Millennium Falcon fly. Like, yeah, it's almost like tears, man. Like, I swear, I'm not... I'm in the theater. I'm gonna admit it, dude. Like, literally, when I saw that Star Wars pop up, man, I'm like, yeah. tearing up just talking about it. It's just like tears run like, in my eye. like, man, this is happening again. This is crazy to me. Yeah. Everyone in the theater, too, like, felt that everyone's clapping. And, like, kind of like trailers like this, like, make that happen for me. Like, when you mash oh, stuff yeah. up, you know what I'm saying? Just, like, knowing other people in the world share that, like, same feeling you do. Yeah. Like, you know, they mash this up. I mean, you didn't have to, right? And yeah. they did. And it's, just, it's awesome, man. It's just, you can see everything. And it's cool, too. You can, like, show, like, Generation Now. You can maybe have a better appreciation for it because it was done oh, this yeah. way. You know what I mean? Especially with the... Um, which I think we should we should talk about on the show too those little the Star Wars shorts, I watched oh, all yeah, the yeah. animation ones the uh, something of he, it's voiced by uh, Dante Rubisco. Is it? I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, Star Wars Dude, shorts. And, and, you know what I'm talking about? We 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 talked about it a couple months ago. They were like literally Dante a minute. Yeah, dude, it's him. You can hear him. he goes in a in the very beginning. He's like in a what is the thing? In the world. Yeah. And, no, it's like something like that. Um, in a galaxy, a long time ago, in a galaxy far, far away. No, 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 no. It's a. Uh, oh no. Um, here I'll figure it out. Um, watch it. You can just just say how you feel about the trailer. I'll, I'll figure it out. I remember. It. I thought the trailer was just okay. Oh snap! Really? No. <laughs> I mean, it was cool. It yeah. wasn't mind blowing I mean, to me. Like I saw people. It's, everyone was sharing it. I was like. It's all right. It's like it's 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 like a love letter of a fan to, to yeah. a property that he that he really cares about. I feel about, like you know? it was just super shared just because it was Topher Grace. Oh. Not, not yeah, I mean that's definitely like... uh, and because he spent like months on this. <laughs> oh. Okay, yeah. I just thought it was okay. I don't know. I I I've just recently I've been so jaded with Star Wars that I guess I don't have nostalgia glasses on. You know? I just mm -hmm. I don't, I, I'm not seeing this and going like Oh, I remember that. And just, just like, yeah. oh my god, the island. Like, You're more like, oh my god, Ryan Johnson. This is all yeah. him. Yeah. 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 And there's no Jar Jar in it. I mean, what the hell's he doing? Not, not including Jar Jar. <laughs> god. The guy. He's the catalyst oh, well, of the, the prequel tril trilogies. Well, something that might get you back in, the, in a little bit of a Star Wars mood is a visit to Disneyland. When, when galaxy's edge releases and we got a couple of more shots of what galaxy's edge will look like you know we got some millennium falcon shots here it's huge yeah it's it's life-size and i want to i want to go <laughs> yeah <laughs> Man, look at this that's the thing that sucks for me is that i really want to go this year but i'm using so much of my vacation time already that i can't but i'm not too uh, sad about man. it because the thing that sucks is I kind of didn't want to go this year because it's the opening year. And Everyone's going to be nuts. there. But yeah. then also, there's probably going to be things that are not ever going to come out again because it's the opening year. You know what I mean? That's like, it's gonna true. Be like, that gave away. Mm. Um, but anyway, side note, I linked you, uh, Harold, in our, in our chat and Discord. There's uh -huh. the, the Yoda versus Dooku one. The part when Yoda comes in and he goes, in a galaxy of adventures, size matters not. But it's he does that on some of the clips. So he'll just talk for like, that's all he says. In a galaxy of adventures, blah, 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 blah. I've never seen that. It, never seen dude, it's thing. sick. There's, there's a lot adventures. of them, dude. There's like, they actually re, they did that in that animation. They did the Darth Vader yeah, we, fight. We've talked of, about uh, it on the on show Rebels. before. We, 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 no, uh, yeah, we, dude, we, I've, yeah. Oh, I've watched all of them. It's really It's on cool. YouTube. I, I recommend it. For, yeah. It's like, uh -huh. it's like bite-sized versions for, for a younger audience because you know how attention span isn't really a thing you have when you're a kid. Uh, so it, it, it kind of chops up a lot of the stories and, and bite-sized stuff and, and in sequences so that you can continue to watch like later on. So it's, sure. it's really good. I, I would recommend it for especially guys with like uncle like, that are uncles or aunts or as like Wancho, in Wancho's case, like if you're a dad or a mom, like it'd be something to watch with a youngin, with a youngling. Oh, yeah. Yeah. A youngling. Yeah, it's um, really good. Not, the fight Leonardo, are sick, 84, dude. though. He has a point. 
I missed the original Clone Wars one. The one, the one that looks like Samurai Jack. Oh, with, uh, with yeah, Tartakovsky. Tartakovsky's, uh... Okay, yeah, you kind of get that vibe from these ones, though, a little bit. Yeah. Like, I'm a little not, bit. I haven't seen it yet. The, no, the fight oh. scenes... It, I mean, yeah, like, show, I that one, show the one I linked, Wancho. It's just... It's really cool. Oh, yeah. it does look cool, yeah. No, it's and it's good. like... And the, especially when the Yoda comes in, dude, it's like an anime fight. He's yeah, like, man. Adventures. He's like, size matters not. Dude, I mean, if they remade the movies like this, I would definitely watch it, dude. Like, it looks crazy. The sounds, too, man. Oh, see, that that gives me one more question before we, we wrap up the show. Would you rather rewatch Star Wars animated like this, or would you rather rewatch it in the way that they Look were doing that, it man. before, it where they so just turn it into... Or where they just remaster everything into 3D, and you have to go in and watch with 3D glasses? I'd honestly... Oh, dude, I'd watch oh, it like God, this. That's pretty cool, yeah. No, yeah. Wancho, if you hear the sound when they clash, it's like, phew, phew. It's, it's, it's awesome, dude. It's literally like an <laughs> anime fight. Like, I can't even, even like, yeah, it's so short. It's like, I wish they made the whole fight scene. Yeah. It's really it, it, cool. It, 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 it's awesome. Cut. Or Clone Wars. No, I'm saying, yeah, exactly. You could do Rebels or another like, Is, Clone Wars that they redid it like this. Oh, my God, dude. So, so far, my favorite... Uh, favorite things to come out of Star Wars have been animated, so to answer your question, Harold, I'd watch right. the entire series. Like, entire, all the movies remade, animated. Ooh, I'm done okay. That's awesome, man. That's awesome. Yeah, so I will say there, too, yeah. there is a place yeah, in the world for this. Watcho was actually the one, I had no idea that Clone Wars was the way it was. I always thought his Clone Wars is the kiddiest thing. Because it and started he was like, out no. kitty. Yeah, like, and he's like, dude, the movie he's like, let me show you this like... clip. And spoiler alert for anyone who hasn't watched it. Um, Man, it's I'm gonna so go good. Play sound. Want to play the sound or no? Uh, oh, wait. Yeah, let me throw it up. Let me throw it up. Hold on. Yeah, Hold just in case gonna... for those uh, uh. watching on the Holy audio. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Holy. There you go. Holy. Holy spoiler alert. There we go. Okay, so, like, Wancho showed me this fight. He's like, dude, you know that Palpatine finds Darth Maul, right? And his brother. I'm like, what? Yeah. Goes, yeah. And he, like, literally owns them. Dude, it was insane. And the fight was cool. Like, I'm not even just saying that. It was a really cool animated fight. And I never yeah. thought Star Wars was like that. Or the, excuse me, Clone Wars was like that. And I'm like, damn. I gotta watch this. There was a freaking dark saber, man. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> it makes a different sound. It's like hella high pitched. It's like, oh, man. That was, and it's it was a cool, flat man. blade. It's an actual blade. Yeah, it's yeah. Yep, there it is, right there, man. It looks, it's, it kind of has. Yeah, it's like I feel like it's like the rebels style, right? You would I say. Mean, yeah, because like they, they really evolved the look of the yeah. show. They really, it took it took time for them to find not just the look but also their their story process and how they would yeah. Because yeah. like at first yeah they wanted to capture all the kids and they did, and that's how they kind of right. transitioned and as the kids grew up because this. Clone Wars ran a lot longer than you would think. Uh, because oh, it's, yeah. it's no, hard it, to remember it, it, when it yeah. started. You'll actually yeah. see Ahsoka grow up. Yeah. 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 So, like, it, it starts off, like, it does kind of start off for the kids. And then it just grows up and it becomes more watchable for for guys our age or older who were already slightly older when, when this came out. And yeah. you... If you're, yeah, if you are kind of our age and stuff, oh, spoilers, sorry guys. Uh, if you are kind of our age, uh, when this was released, you you do have to power through like the first season or so, and yeah. then it gets good, it gets deep. Yeah. Uh, you're still yeah, gonna get your probably. Senate episodes and your Droid episodes where you could kind of skip them, but at the same time, it does a great job of expanding the universe, which is really what you yeah. wanted from out of this show and what we kind of lack right now. Yeah, I and agree. I, and I really like the droid episodes, actually. <laughs> well, the one where they have to save R2. Oh, there were some that were good. Uh, don't get me yeah. wrong. Oh, there yeah. were some yeah. that I enjoyed. But there's some that were just like, when is this done? <laughs> oh, yeah. First season, yeah. there's definitely a lot of that. Yeah, there's, yeah. there's so much to that, yeah. But yeah I think uh, a lot of good shows are like that, you know what I mean? Like, even good mm -hmm. animes, really draggy starts. But then it's like, yeah. this is a really good anime. Yeah, definitely, definitely, because it takes some time for the showrunners to, to find their footing. Yeah. Right, no, exactly, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, guys, that, that's 
Man, there's so much to look forward to this year. I totally forgot Star Wars was this year. Yeah, me yeah. too. They always like they did it um for seven too, right? Or excuse me, for eight. The trailer came pretty late. Yeah. I remember was everyone like was like, dude, where is it at? Yeah, we're like, okay, here it is. Yeah. Um this might be smart Real because quick, he, he's Yeah. We actually didn't get to talk about Hondo. <laughs> oh well yeah, oh, I, I yeah. flashed him I flashed some video online, that's fine. Hondo Anaka has yeah. an animatronic at Galaxy's Edge, so it's, it's kind of weird. Like, how they made uh, making an animatronic is a lot of work, and they picked Hondo. That's like, <laughs> well, he is one of the more entertaining ones. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, that's weird. Yeah, why not Jar Jar? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Me not be a mistake. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, oh, I feel like yeah, people so, would like just tear it up, like just yeah. throw stuff at it. <laughs> yeah. Oh man. Oh my god. All right. Well, that's it, guys. Uh, oh, let me let me play us out here. Any final final thoughts on today's topics of news? Yeah, Team uh, Mystic for life, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pokemon Renaissance, Renaissance, man. I'm, I'm surprised at how long we actually. Talk like so little news <laughs> it's yeah. more of like the quality like Dude, like when you actually think talk, about we didn't even talk about dragon prince man oh shoot you still want we can still do it we can still do it uh, yeah talk about it. or do you want to save it all like all for next week your call we your did call. have no, a lengthy discussion on pokemon i mean if we had that with that with trailers <laughs> we could probably talk about a show for like the entirety if we had wanted to. Okay, so Usually next week we is, is all Dragon week, Prince. Week. Yeah, next week yeah, is all, all Dragon Prince. Prince. We'll, we'll do all Dragon Prince. Uh, so that people- That all right to me. Yeah, <laughs> everyone has to, you know, I'll, I'll do proper build up for that. I'll do a proper like clip of, of, of an, for, for Ooh, to hype it up. Next week is also Spider-Verse. No, we'll, 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 we'll do Spider-Verse separately. I think I think Dragon okay. Prince deserves its own. Since since Wantra, you'll be coming from the first season. I think we can we can spare some time to, to do okay. do them separately, but I want. Yeah, you'll you guys definitely to have a fresher mind. Yeah, because you watch yeah. the first through the second. Yeah, it's one of those shows, right? Where I wanted to say this today. It's one of those shows where once you get going, you don't want to stop. Kind of like. Uh, oh Avatar. right, exactly. Yeah, exactly. And it's yeah. nice because they're shorter, so you just like okay, next one, let's go. Yeah, yeah. It's like you're not like Daredevil. Each. You're like, uh, it's an hour. Uh, <laughs> tomorrow. Yeah, <laughs> it's, a, it's a show definitely built for Netflix. Yeah, yes, yeah, for sure. Uh -huh. I agree. For sure, for sure. All right. So, any other final thoughts, guys? Pokemon Renaissance uh, from the Pokemon Renaissance man, Wancho Saldana. Derek, man, any thoughts? Any other thoughts? I'm just really excited that there is a Pokemon Conquest game, and I'm probably gonna look that up and maybe try it out because I never knew that existed. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Mirage Leonardo, for that. By the way. <laughs> Yeah, and thank you for I, Ansishu for, for the copy. <laughs> just think, man. If I see, it's just things like this, you guys, that make me happy. If I never met you guys, we never did the show, I would have never oh. found out about that game, ever. Yeah, or you, it'd be too late. Like, you'd find out because you went into a, a retro video game store, and you were like, what? Yeah. Where was like, this? What game is, I'm like, what? This, this, what? what? <laughs> yeah, I know. Probably when the, yeah. watch, I mean, watch it like, stuff, though, and you're like, oh, thanks for nothing, guys. <laughs> no, I, I'll agree. I mean, I hope I'm gonna try to agree with Murad. He said it was dope, so I will take it. Francis said it was good too. I'll take it. I'll take it. I think the DS will probably die though soon because of Switch. Oh man. Oh no. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I mean, just be. Yeah, I mean, so you can take it anywhere. You, you know what I mean? It's just the same same idea. Same size, yeah. actually a smaller disc even, or uh, excuse me, games. Yeah. More, more yeah, space anyway. within the Switch. How are you, Harold? Any final thoughts? Final thoughts? Uh, yeah, I, I was not expecting to to get into Pokemon so much, and just breaking down uh, the Detective Pikachu trailer. We we barely got we barely touched the story, and it's because the visuals just really capture our imagination of how we want it. Like it's it's what you wanted from a Pokemon live action movie. Uh, we, we've said this multiple times already, and I'm just going to say it one more time again. Uh, I hope this is the gateway. I hope this is the precursor to more live-action Pokemon movies, because 
there is a space for this, you know, like how Marvel tells multiple types of stories, but with superheroes, you know, they could tell you a heist movie. Uh, I'm sure they could, they could find a way to give us a rom-com, which they kind of did with Ant-Man and the Wasp. Uh, right, there's right. so much that they could do in the Pokemon universe. <laughs> There's, there's kind of no excuse not to at this point, you know. Like they can What's give the, you the underdog the story. Again? Uh, Iron, Iron Man. Man. Was it Iron Man? This could be the yeah. Iron Man of the Pokemon universe. <laughs> oh my god! No pressure. Just no start pressure. off. You know, a whole thing, a trend of Just things. Ryan, Ryan Reynolds is gonna be the next Robert. Yeah. Yeah. Pika. 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 Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah, that's it. So, I'm not gonna forget this time, but we gotta say thank you to all our most recent followers. Heartland Media, Jason underscore Chakrazel, Really Plushy, Bounds, or Bones, Esports Redux, Saltazar, Lazarus PH, Renzo Saurus, our newest shoutcaster on Quit Stalling, Aaron Claire, and Ajo King 87 Thank you guys so much. We gotta give a ton of props to the people keeping us fed here on Quit Stalling like human panda who is on his nine month in a row sub but he's also gifted 12 subs as well to everyone uh for Sishu, miku p sensei humor bimo king of neo gear ion hammer stream eden steady monster plays 13 but ninja and a bunch of others who who aren't in the top 10 right now thank you everyone for supporting us for this long our bit thank cheers neo gear who's been cheering us on. He's got 3,000 nope underscore plays in second. Elder Jin, who's bought his way into the show. Nerf Diva, if not now, Glenn Mershi, Game Ako, Tita Gamings, InstaDZ again, and of course, wah, underscore. Guys, let's start off with Derek. Where can the folks at home find you when you are not on the Quit Stalling Geek Cast? Y'all can find me on Twitch at and say humor uh you can stream monday to fridays uh like i mentioned earlier in the show me and wancho and um some of you may know nick as well we, we also play i've been playing that a lot uh and strangely i haven't been playing fortnite a lot i've been playing regardless of season eight coming around i've been playing a lot of apex legends um a lot of it so if you guys want to come around <laughs> wancho is really happy about that so Stick around for that. Um, I try to play different types of games, guys. So, yeah, some fish there. Awesome. What about awesome. you, Wancho? Where can they find you? Well, you can find me here on the Quit, Quit Stalling Geek Cast or my Ooh. Twitter handle, which is at Saldana Wancho or Instagram at Wancho Saldana. Oh, or if you're going to the Fatime, you can catch me there. Oh, nice. Wancho's nice. fans can check him out at Fatime. Be sure to do that. Oh, if you guys want Wancho Man, I'm excited to, to meet you for the first time at Fandom. Oh, <laughs> 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 uh, yeah. Yeah, check him out, guys, at Fandom. Host, shoutcaster, to Wancho Soldado. If you guys want to check me out outside of the Quit Song Geek Cast, I do Game Bite with our other friends like Diego Z and the Fury Bot, Nick de Guzman. Wednesday nights, 9 30 p.m. Philippine Standard Time, 6 30 a.m. California, or check all of it out on Spotify. Apple Podcasts and anywhere you can get your podcast. Uh, you could also find me on Quit Songs Overwatch Community Scrim Nights. That's every other week ish here on Quit Stalling as well. Just just check out the videos tab if you haven't seen them yet. Uh, you can find me on at Harold Plays on Twitter, on Instagram, and of course twitch.tv slash Harold Plays. If you want to find more Quit Stalling goodness, check out our Facebook and our Twitter, our social medias. Facebook.com slash quit stalling us or on Twitter at quit stalling us. That's quit stalling us. You can find us on Instagram at quit stalling on YouTube, youtube.com slash quit stalling and on Twitch, twitch.tv slash quit stalling. If you like our stuff, subscribe, follow, like, cheer us on with some bits, do everything you want with all our social media. And of course, leave us a five star review on anywhere that you listen to our podcast, whether it's Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and so much more. Again, the Quit Stalling Geek Cast and Game Byte, G-A-M-B-Y-T-E. That is it for us this week on the Quit Stalling Geek Cast. We'll see you guys next week. Same bat time. Sorry, same bat time. Same bat channel. Till then, get off your butts and quit stalling. It's been a great show, guys. We'll see you next week. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye. See ya.
さよう。